Good day, everyone. Today, I am going to tackle on how I create my 3D pop-up effect Instagram photo using Photoshop CC 2019. If you are interested to learn, relax and pay attention. Today's tutorial, you will learn the following. First, market tool. Second, mask and crop tool. The third one, polygonal lasso tool to select an object or photo. It is another way to select an object or photo without including the background. You can still use the quick selection, magic wand, and even the pencil. The end of the day, it is your own choice which one you are comfortable to use. Fourth, Select and mask. The fifth one, clipping mask. Sixth, how to create pop out shadow effect or 3D effect using brush tool. Now let's start. Open the screenshot of the Instagram in Photoshop, double click the background to release the layer, and rename it into layer 0 or any name you like to put. Press our back in Mac or Backspace in Windows. Click the Crop tool and set the size into 4 by 5 and enter. Please note, you need to duplicate the, the layer 0. I deleted it later on this video. Click Place Embedded to paste the background photo of the Instagram by locating the file from your computer or hard drive and click Open. When you already open the background photo, resize it by dragging the points to make it bigger or smaller, then drag its layer below the layer 0. Now we will place the photo or the model. We have to follow the same process. Click Place Embedded and insert the photo. To select a photo without including the background, I use Polygonal Lasso tool. I am using this tool because I want to carefully select the photo of myself but you can still use quick selection tool or magic wand and even pen tool. It is just a matter of choice. Now, click the layer mask icon to delete or hide the background. Then, adjust the photo in order to be in proportion. Hold the shift key to avoid distorting the content. Right click the mask layer, choose the select and mask to refine the edges of the photo.
Let's proceed. Right click the layer 0 and duplicate it by right clicking the layer 0 and choose duplicate layer. Now click create clipping mask. For your info, I use clipping mask to create a shadow pop-out effect to my picture without affecting the background photo when I start to use the brush tool. Okay, click the brush tool and click the layer zero copy to start creating a shadow effect. Use the brush tool to tap stroke the arm and legs where the white area of the Instagram screenshot to have 3D pop out effect. Just carefully do it until you achieve the shadow effect you like. For the final step, you can do the final retouch and that's it guys. Don't be afraid to do a trial and error process. Through this, we will learn. Thank you so much for watching, hope you learned and like it. Have a wonderful weekend everyone, see you next week, bye, ciao!